Here are the key themes for the short story The Red Door by Ian Crichton Smith. The Red Door explores two principal themes or issues. Here's a quick overview of each of them. One, the individual versus society or individuality versus conformity. Firstly, Crichton Smith contrasts Murdo's meek acceptance of the conventions imposed on his life by the other villagers. For example, I have never had the courage to wear what I wanted to wear. With Mary's courageous individuality and her refusal to worry about what other people think of her. For example, her world was her own, depending on none. Secondly, he explores how the catalyst of the Red Door, with its suggestion of a new exciting future, leads to Murdo having not just one but two epiphanic experiences. Firstly, the realisation that he has never truly been able to be himself before. Secondly, the realisation that there is actually nothing stopping him from leaving the village. Even though he is middle-aged, he is described as being stunned by the thought of leaving. This new insight triggers a significant change in Murdo's perspective on life, which results in him resolving to assert his individuality and defy the community's claustrophobic expectations. It is this decision that leads him to Mary's door by the end of the story, from where he looks back at his own door. It is described at this point as having emerged out of the old and the habitual, highlighting that Murdo is turning his back on his previous humdrum life. Thus, in The Red Door, Crichton Smith effectively uses the symbolism of The Red Door, coupled with the characterisation of both Murdo and Mary, to highlight the importance of being able to express your individuality and not to be so worried about what others may think of you that you put aside or ignore your personal hopes and dreams, as the text suggests Murdo's parents may have done, just because your aspirations do not necessarily fit in with those of other members of society. Two. The reality of life in a small rural community. Several stereotypical aspects of village life are explored in the Red Door. The villagers clearly gossip about Mary because she's different from them, which highlights the limiting, oppressive nature of life in a conventional, orthodox village such as the one where this story is set. This is symbolic of the way in which society at large expects people to conform, making it challenging for us to retain our individuality. This is shown by Murdo's experiences of life in the village prior to his epiphany. As the story of the Red Door unfolds, several aspects of life in a small community are revealed and explored, and they are all negative. Firstly, the narrow-minded attitude of the inhabitants. They might not even want him in the village. Secondly, their suspicion of anything new or different. What would the neighbours say? Thirdly, their prejudice against Mary who is considered slightly odd. And fourthly, the overwhelming feeling of obligation to comply with other residents' expectations, as demonstrated by, if they think I should go to church, I go to church. Thank you for watching this video and hope you found it useful. See you next time. In other videos on The Red Door, we look at an overview and key quotes from the story. If you found this or any of our other videos useful, it would be great if you could subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thanks for your support.